scale, it's, like I said, auto balancing. So I can actually literally, if I go to the controller, if I let go, here I'll make sure it doesn't move. <laughs> it's just going to hover, basically, right? Yeah. When you want it to move, it's fast. If I watch it, so I can tap it a little bit, right? Or I can hold it, one, two, three, stop. I stop moving, it stops moving, okay? The right button, or the right controller, you push up, it goes forward, down it goes backward, left and right as I already showed you. There's no learning curve, so watch my finger. Random movement doesn't do anything. The only thing you have to learn on anyone that we carry is the up, down on the left. You just practice moving this up and down, nice and slow. When you learn that, now you've mastered everything that we carry. It's made to be user friendly and easy to learn. While you're practicing, you might have landings like that. So you see how it bounces. I was explaining before, uh, protective bendable plastic, right? So that protects break. If you do that hard enough, enough times, sure, you can break a piece off. Four screws and I think it's like $8 to buy your landing gear. But you can, if you buy more parts, you buy full part helicopters. This one will sell for about, I think, Hundred dollars. That's with an extra digital camera and an extra lithium battery and every piece. What's the run time? The run time is going to be about ten minutes. <laughs> Sorry. The run time is going to be about ten minutes, maybe a little bit more. Um, if you want to go like fifty of them, that's full throttle, right? Uh, if you're about, if you're hovering, if you're doing what I'm doing, so you're going to go twenty. Minutes. If you want to fly full throttle longer, now we have extra battery. So you can buy them out of the parts helicopter. We order separate boxes of batteries. You want to fly an hour, fly an hour. How does it, how does it do in Saskatchewan wind? Well, I'm from Manitoba. That's where Man, I'm same, born. Same difference. Same thing. Yeah. Uh, this is this is what I tell people. Be logical, you'll be fine. Zero to 10, 10 kilometers, no problem. Fifteen, you have to learn a pilot. Meaning you have to learn to compensate for wind a little bit. You go up to twenty, you're supposed to not do it. I do it. Uh, it, it just, and you take I'm, your chances that it'll run away? or No, it's not going to run away. It just We tell people not to do that with our product because it's not going to be fun for most people at first. Right? Because it's going to be pushed back and you're, oh, you know, I just want to yeah. fly it around, right? When you buy a hobby grade one, not from us, but if you go to a hobby store, they're going to also tell you don't fly outside 20 kilometer winds. The reasons are different. For them, you're spending one to five plus thousand dollars. You, it can go 100 miles an hour, you can fly, but it crashes, you just spend two, three hundred dollars. So they don't do it because of cost. It's not as much fun, but it's mostly cost. This, it's not going to be as much fun. You can go and you fly and you crash it, you're right, no problem. You buy five dollars of parts and you're flying it for ten dollars. You know, like something, like it's 15, like, I don't know, like it's, yeah. tiny well, amounts of money. It's plastic, just plastic, yeah. <laughs> You're replaceable plastic, plastic. that screws in and out so yeah. but again i've flown these in 30 kilometers but that's because i've flown these for a long time so i know certain moves how to bounce it and give it extra momentum blah 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 and it's fun because i've done it for so long but that's what's become fun for me right because at first just just the challenge of the speed of this that's plenty and also you're recording video at the same time we're doing photo down i showed you the video yeah mm -hmm. Press this. Oh yeah. For a second, it starts recording the video. You snap the other one over and over. It takes photo, like uh, still photos, like photographs. So that's uh, enough. That's plenty for starting off. What does it do to transfer to the computer or? It's, or? it's just like just uh, like USB. Just okay, in. like the that wire is for battery, or is there another port on it, or how does that? Oh, uh, for, for, Good catch. Good catch. This is our replacement model for our camera helicopter. The other one didn't actually go as fast. So this might become our permanent model. They have the same features, same specs, but speed, it's more on this one. So I believe, I haven't fully checked it out. I know it's extremely easy. Literally all I would have had to do is take Looks like an SD card slot there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. It's. I know these are simple. Everything we buy is meant to be very easy. I literally just have to take the manual and read for 15 
minutes to 60 seconds, it's not hard. It's yeah. Everything on here is designed to be extremely user friendly for people that don't have a clue what they're doing. Where's the camera face at the front? Okay, so or? this is what I recommend. It has full, like you can go straight and all the way through like this. Oh, if you're yeah. going 10 feet in the air, 10, 20 feet, just keep it straight. You'll know what you're shooting. The camera's, the helicopter's facing that way. Mm -hmm. If you go higher up, I just recommend just going all the way. So you're just getting, you'll get a full scope. Okay. If you don't want to press the camera button, just let it hover every now and then. Like I was hovering it, let it hover. And when you're done, freeze frame and get your photos like that. Have or you, camera. Have you seen the video that yeah. you've recorded? It's, it's, yes, it's HD. It's great. It's going to be really good, yeah. The one that we had before was very good. Like it was very good. I had zero complaints of camera quality and this one's a lot better. The only people that would have complaints are the people who wouldn't buy it. People who are doing like film, like in film school. They buy one of these and they just buy their own like $500 crazy whatever camera and just mount it. Okay, these ones can carry more in other words. These or... can carry weight, no problem. Well, just like this is carrying this, you can go buy a mini GoPro and snap it on one of those. It's just going to cost you more and you're going to use two controls. So What's the price difference? Is, uh... Well, it's set up also in a way that you can't go buy a good camera and this one and save money. You'll spend more and it'll be less convenient, right? Um, so what we do at the shows, we retail them $100 off their full retail. It sells for 400 bucks, camera, warranty, everything included. So to show you guys for 300, 250 and 200, okay? Uh, so the difference between this, it's gonna be obvious. More expensive, goes faster and farther. This one, the only difference is supposed to be a uh, camera. But in this particular case, it actually does go faster. It's not supposed to, but it does. So it's better, actually. People like that, mm -hmm. which is why we might keep this one instead. Um, on top of it, when you buy one of these, we make a point of selling you a small one. Crack the little one into the big one. At the show, we give it to you for free. Hmm. So you get an indoor model, we sell it for 60 or two for 90 as a show promotion only. But anyways, you get that $60 helicopter for free if you're buying a giant one. Usually, we try to encourage you just to buy one. So you get your indoor and you get 100 bucks off. And that's it, man. Cool. Pretty cool stuff. Yeah. yeah. I've always been interested in models. Like back in the day, it was way more complicated to build things. And of course, like quadcopters didn't exist. So. Yeah. When gyro started, like three years ago, became mainstream. Sales for these things worldwide went like yeah, <laughs> it's, it's still going. On. Yeah, well, you can have your own drone basically that doesn't shoot uh, bad things. Yeah, and, and even <laughs> just the gyro. You know what I showed you that balancing system? Yeah. Every store they could have those ones. They don't. It costs. More. It costs more for us to buy the cell phone. And then we service them. Services cost a lot of money too. So we pay more. We do more service, and then we charge more. I could go buy a, let a cheaper version of this, offer you no know, service and sell it to you for $190, right? Mm -hmm. But uh, especially for people buying big ones, um, you're not going to save money. You can go buy like a liquidation or whatever, you know, mini one for 20, 25 bucks or something like that, crash it, burn it. If you keep buying them over and over, you're still gonna lose out on money. If you do it once and then yeah, that was fun, Okay, so fine, you can save money. But on these ones, no one buys this just to play it once. You buy something like this, even if you get for, like like on eBay for a hundred bucks. Something happens, it's done, you buy another one. Something happens, it's done, you buy another one. Mm -hmm. And then never mind quality. Quality is a different stuff. These are much better. You get what you pay for, these are gonna be better. And then because of service, eventually something's gonna happen, whether it's one day or two years. And then you buy like a two-dollar piece. Mm -hmm. To get the um, ten minutes flying time, how much charging time is that approximately? Ten to fifteen, and you're looking at on the giant ones, you're looking an hour, maybe two at the most. And do they have swappable batteries, or is it easy to replace the batteries? It's a lithium battery, just pop, just like every other piece, just comes right in there. Okay. See, here's how you fix every part of this helicopter. That snaps off. Screws takes this out. Plugs and two screws takes that out. One, two, soldering gun takes that out. Everything else literally snaps off or unscrews. Nice. That's it. Back motor, couple screws, a plug, pull it up. That's it. Anyone who's who has a screwdriver. What kind of drive shaft is it from here to there? Or is it the motor right here? The, the motor's, motor's right here. there, okay. Yeah. 
It's just a wire going through. Yeah. You can see it coming through here. I got gotcha. you. And into the circuit board. Super easy, man. Yeah, that's It's cool. designed in such a way where we might have distributors in various places and we might go to different places many times a year. But if you want something like now, you want you, something happens, you want it now, mm -hmm. it takes two to three days to ship. We have a conversation, it takes a few days, it's up. Have you got a business card? I'll throw this video on YouTube. Yeah, for sure. Do you want to buy one? Maybe not. No? Not not that kind of impulse buyer. No? Okay. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for the demo, that was great. One by two?